things are brought. So I'm saying that over there, you know, workers are paid. First, their pay is rated on an hourly basis. So the US, for instance, I hear them arguing that the minimum pay, they want to take it to $15 an hour. Okay, that, so they, that's what they call their minimum pay. It's an, an hourly pay. Unlike here, when we say our minimum uh, pay, it's, a, it's like a, a daily, daily pay. That, you know, so it's now, the, our minimum pay here is about $2 a day. Okay. Over there, they do it on an hourly basis. So when you go to work, you go and clock, clock in. There's a machine, you clock in, you put your card in. It indicates the time that you entered your workplace. At the end of the day, you clock out. So it indicates how many hours you have worked. And then at the end of the week, the manager aggregates your number of hours that you have worked, multiplied by your hourly pay, and that is your paycheck. Okay? So, you know, in a, uh, there's a popular saying in a country it says, Ukoko ni anaxipe. And I'm saying that, it, uh, that uh, it builds in some kind of, you know, uh, return um, for the, the money that you are giving. You are also putting in something. Yeah? So, you are paying for productivity. You know, instead of here that they say the minimum pay is this per day, but uh, but of course you are paid at the end of every month. Some people will escape work for various reasons, and they are the manager will favor them, their supervisor for some reasons. You know, they don't come to work, so they don't produce. But at the end of the month, you pay them, and I'm saying that. Now, in economics, there are two sides of um, the, the economy. In other words, the production side and the income side. So, as people produce, they generate income. Or they are paid an income. People produce and they are paid income. And money is being accepted as the medium that we use. So, you pay them money. If they have not produced and you are paying them money, you are devaluing the money. The money will have no value. Because what is the money going to buy? <laughs> you are paying people, they haven't produced goods and services for their money to go and buy. And then you are, you are just giving them more money. So that, that, that's what I'm saying. But this is something that a government should take the initiative and say, I'm going to start with this, maybe from the, the public service or somewhere, start, start it. And, and let's see whether you can expand it to the rest of the economy.